guys and gals it's Thunder here and welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! unboxing video and today we're going to be opening up the legendary dragon decks um when this came out looked it up online i was excited to see what was in this set i bought two of them one I already opened because there's cards i want to add to my main dragon deck so that's what we did um so there's three decks, just like the two Yugi deck, you know, the legendary deck stuff, which was pretty cool. You know, it's like. Alright, what should we do first? Get them all out of here. Oh man, dude. Legendary Dragon Dicks. Interesting. We'll do, we'll do it like that. Nah. Legendary Dragon Decks. Three decks. Now, I'm not going to really review these cards. I'm just going to go through and open them up, sleeve up the rares, or the, you know, the foils and stuff like that. So, the reason we got these decks, I'm going to put all the foils aside here. We'll go over them. Go over them later. Alright, so. For the Legendary Dragon decks. First one. Um, what's it called? The Atlas deck. So this has got. The Dark Magician, Dark Magician Girl. Magician's Robe. Dark, you know, three Dark Magicians. Magician's Robe. Rod. Uh, <clears throat> Skilled Dark, uh, Legendary Knight Tamias, Critias, and Hair Mouse, Breaker, Magical Importer, Big Shield Gardener, whatever that card is, Dark Magic Curtain, Illusion Magic, Dark Magic Expanded, Probably a thousand eyes dark mansion. Eye of Tamias, that really good to get out dark um, uh, dark paladin if you have dark magician on the field. Cloth Hermos um, to get out that. Uh, what's this name? That, uh, this card here. Can I get that to focus? What the hell is going on? Oh, no, that's not what I want. I don't want it. I want this. That's the card right there, the dark, the red eyes, uh, 
Black Dragon Sword. That's the whole point of this is why I got this deck. Now for the foils, we have Magician's Navigation. Eternal Soul, so now I have three. Dark Magical Circle. Prentice's Illusion of Magician, uh, Magician, and then we have the Dark Magician, the Dark Magician Dragon Knight. So those are our foils there. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve those up in our Eclipse, Eclipse White and Black Sleeves. So, excited for this deck. Because it's going to help out my main Dragon deck a lot. It's going to help out... I got a spellcaster deck I'm running as well, and it's gonna help that deck out quite a bit as well. So, with the apprentice magician, it helps with getting dark magician out, I believe. Could be wrong. But yeah, that's the whole point of the deck. So, yeah. So, that's the whole point having those how about my magician deck I would like to get another illusion magician um, I'll probably have to get a Yugi Ten or a Kaiba Ten um, just to do it I don't know if I'm gonna open that I've already opened up what well I have opened up two Kaiba Tens I've only opened up one Yugi Ten but we're gonna go ahead and look at the Cyber Dragon deck this deck is pretty dope actually um, I might actually make the deck in real life um, just cyber dragon deck my brother wants to have the machina fortress I got two of them he wants to have three he's only got one so it's unfortunate I have to give that card up but that's all right if I could make a cyber dragon deck with these cards and I do have like a little scratched up for me scratching on the thing. I wish there was a better way to do these. Now again we'll go over these at the end here. Alright, so basically this deck consists of Cyber Dragons, Cyber Dragon Zoo Eyes, Cyber Dragon Good Eyes, Cyber Dragon again, Cyber Dragon, and then the Cyber Dragon Core. Cyber Valley. That guy is like the main beast of this deck. Like, what you gotta do is uh, this card cannot be normal. So, I'm must accept some from him by banishing all light monsters from your field and graveyard. This attack becomes the number of banished special times 500. When this card is special summoned, to an all color field, face up field. This guy's basically a one turn win. There's that Machina Fortress. Cyber Repair Plant, uh, Cybernetic Fusion, Evolution Burst, Power Bond, Overload, Future Fusion. Now I have two Future Fusions. Blazing Rift with Cyber and Dragons in here. Cyber Twin. And then this guy's in here. I do have the Hollow Mission and the Cyber Nova, which is a pretty dope card. Because you can basically take your spells and traps and all that and make it as its material I believe I think that's how that card works so yeah that deck that card is pretty OP but here is the foils we have here we have cyber dragon infinity I think it's this one I believe uh, the rampage dragon uh, the cyber network cyber replayer plant then we got Kometric Mega Fleet Dragon. It's pretty much the same as the other one that I showed. So yeah, that's basically what that deck has. Not a bad deck. Um, I'm probably going to make it one of my main decks. So that's going to be probably one I'm going to use. It's not going to be like a Machina, like my brother's got, but I think it would do good on its own. Now the pot of duality is going to my Exodia deck. 
Now, I do plan on getting, I believe, Legendary Dex 2 again. I will not upload that. I gotta get two sets of Dex, uh, two of those, because it's got Whitestone of the Agents in it. And I only have one. So that's where Whitestone of the Agents is. And that's what I need for my Dragon Deck. And and it's gonna have two more, I'm gonna have two more Exodia card Incarnates. And I'm gonna be able to actually utilize that card to its full potential so I can't wait for that so that's gonna be fun and I do want to do like series of for Yu-Gi-Oh Nexus like you guys like viewers pick the decks I use to face other people I wouldn't mind doing that so this is the Pendulum Dragon deck, which is the basically the Odd Eyes deck. So I can actually finally make this type of deck. So that's going to be fun, so I might end up using it to see how it goes. So we got Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon, Odd Eyes uh, Supreme King, uh, Odd Eyes, another Pendulum Dragon, Odd Eyes Persona Dragon. Basically, it's the pendulum deck for it. Then this guy is good. I've used him. Odd Eyes Gravity Dragon. He's pretty dope. Odd Eyes Fusion had tons of those. Spiral Frame, Flame Strike, Pendulum Storm, Pot of Riches, Terraforming. Good card to have. Then we got these uh, fusions and the synchros and the XYZs. So that deck might be interesting to have as well made. Now here are the foils for these. We got Odd Eyes, Air, Arc, Pendulum Dragon. We got Odd Eyes, Pendulum Dragon. We have Striving and Venom Fusion. I think I have that card. Uh, Cyberwing, Synchro Dragon, and this guy is pretty dope. I I'm glad I have two of those. Dark Rebel uh, Rebe Rebellion XYZ Dragon. He's pretty dope. Uh, his effect is you can detach two materials from the sky. Target one monster your opponent controls and attack becomes half that attack. So, and he has a card against the attack, and it's permanent. So, that's pretty dope. So I'm thinking about adding it to my main deck, or I might add it to, I might just keep it in the Odd Eyes deck. It's going to be an Odd Eyes Red Eyes deck, because if I'm going to get Legendary Deck 2 twice, I'll have three Black Stones of Legends, and that that deck's going to be pretty good as well. So I can't wait, I'll have, a, I'm going to have quite a few decks, and it's actually going to work pretty decent, pretty good. Can't wait for that. I might make it the Odd Eyes its own deck. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys this deck. Because these, this, these decks. Because why not? So this, and you get three decks, and you're, you got a stack of cards like that. So. So let's go ahead and go over our foils and call it a video, shall we? So we got the, the Clear Wing Synchro Dragon. Uh, we got the Striving, the Striving Venom Fusion Dragon. Uh, the Mega Fleet Dragon. Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon. Okay, we got Dark Rebellion. XYZ Dragon, we got Odd Eyes Arc Pendulum Dragon, we got Cyber Power Plant, we got Dark Magician Knight, or Dark Magician of the Dragon Knight. I don't know, people say he's not very good. I mean, when your opponent uh, targets, uh, cannot target Spell Types, Card Control, Card Effects, uh, Cyber Network. The Rampage Dragon, Dark Magic uh, Circle, Prentice Magician, Cyber Infinity Nova, Internal Soul, and Michigan's, er, Magician's Navigation. 
Alright you guys, if you guys enjoyed that video, if you did, feel free to give it a like, also comment, and subscribe to your new channel. And also, let me know what you guys thinks, think of this legendary Dragon Knight. Is it worth it? I bought two of them because I had the cards I need, so now I don't have to really get the booster box of those cards. Um, and basically, buying that equivalent to a booster box for Yu-Gi-Oh! So... Yeah, I mean, not a bad thing. You're getting foils like this. Um, it'd be a good Christmas gift for your kid. If you have a kid, uh, I think they would like it. Um, especially if they like uh, Dark Magician cards. Uh, to help out their Dark Magician deck or whatever. Or even just to collect. You know, because I'm a collector and I also play the game with my uh, friends and uh, my uh, brothers. Now, there is another thing I would like to do in real life, duel in real life, and record it and upload it to YouTube. That would be freaking fun. Like, because I got a buddy who hit me up the other day. He saw one of my Yu Gi Oh videos. He's like, dude, we should duel sometime and record it for YouTube or something. And I said, sure, we'll, we'll do it. Or we can even do it online as well. So, that's what I got planned. But this was interesting. Um, you're getting, what? Four foils per deck. So that's eight, sixteen. Something like that. Yeah, sixteen. Sixteen foils. Alright guys, I'm going to leave it at that. If you guys enjoyed it, feel free to give it a like. Also, comment, subscribe to your new channel. And also, be sure to check out other YouTubers because they need you as much as I do. And I'll see you in the next Yu-Gi-Oh! unboxing video. That was a pretty epic opening.